viewers in this video i'm going to tell you how you can fix your casio fx 991 es plus not turning on or working problem as you can see i'm going to on it and it's not working so how you can fix this at home so viewers watch the video till the end so let's get started with the video so first of all what you must have is a screw driver like this okay so if you have then it's okay but if you don't then you must bout it so f what you have to do first of all uh, remove the screws of your calculator so I'm going to remove one by one each and here it goes for first one And this is the second, this is the third one, the fourth one, and the last, but not the least. and i'm now trying to open this up but it's not opening because this one is left right here so now you can see i can open this up see it has been opened as you can see here's no cell and no other wires that are connected to this so here's the cell okay so what you have to do is remove the cell I will turn this up to this so that it will be easy to remove so you have to remove this cell like this very carefully you have to remove okay you have to simply push the cell towards forward from here You must be very careful. As you can see, I have removed it. First of all, I uh, pushed it from here, downside, and then from the upper side here, and it came out. So, here's the cell. As you can see, it's, uh, you can't see it well, but it is, uh, I will try to show you up. It's CR2025. So what you have to do, whichever cell you have, you have to see which uh, number it is written on up. So uh, I will bring a new cell of this type. So what you have to do, you have to also bring a new cell from the shop of watches or whichever shop where you can find this cell up. So we was, I have bought up a new cell which is CR2025 uh, the same as the before one was uh, you can see uh, it but it's CR2025 the same that uh, I have this one because it's uh, the problem is with the calculator is that uh, the cell is not were working okay so what you have to do is bring a new cell so i have bought it so what you have to do is put it not from here but from here inside your calculator so i will do it so as you can see i am uh, going to put it in so for the best position i will use the screw driver for it as you can see it has been placed well now so now uh, what you have to do is again uh, put your uh, calculator back side up and put all the screws back to it 
now the cover is up on the calculator and you have to put the screws back one by one again so I'm going to do it so I will change the position of this So viewers I have only tightened the three screws of my calculator which are 1, 2 and 3 and if I uh, move the front side of my calculator and if now you can see that it's working it has been fixed in front uh, in the video I have told you how you can fix this so you can see it's working so I have not put back all the screws but I will put them right now so just to show you guys that the calculator is working now and it has been fixed up so, so we first hope so you liked my video share comment and subscribe my youtube channel get information and knowledge and click on the notification bell on all to get a notification of my latest uploaded information and knowledge videos